Really, Florida? 49 degrees and it's almost May. Killing me. Hope that don't screw up the fishing. Sorry, clients, if, it does, if we don't catch anything. Apologize ahead of time. All right, I'm gonna give you guys a sneak peek right here. Let me show you guys something. You guys can guess what that is. If you watched yesterday's video, you should know. So let's talk a little bit about what's going on today. I'm actually meeting my clients and David. David is all you guys know. He's, uh, he's my new employee. He runs our beach shark fishing charters as well as inshore fishing charters. So I'm meeting both of them down there. David's gonna deck can for me today and uh, just help me out with some stuff. Also wanting to ride with me to maybe learn some new inshore technique. Bring in the expensive reel. Man, that's a good one there. Yes, sir. Yeah, come on in. Van stall. Shadow. Yeah, nice. Um, Put that right there, the man. Stall? Yeah, how's it going? I'm Brant. Hey, What's going on, man? Brent, it's good to yeah. finally meet you. Good to meet you too, man. That's David. He helps me out. He actually runs this boat a lot. So. All right, guys, hang on. Stone, right here. That's probably another. That's probably a nice Spanish. Stud Spanish, swing him over here. That is a monster. <laughs> Look at that. That's a good one. Coolest way to catch mackerel right here. Check out this long shank hook. We do that so that the, uh, the teeth do not fray the line. All right, go ahead and tie it on, David. Tag in real quick. All right, grab us a shrimp. The tail, one side out the other. All right, fling him out there. There you go. Reel it in just a little bit, because we want it to sink down. Once it gets to a certain level, they're gonna smash it. All right, let's put it in the rod holder. So do you do the filming for the Weather Channel, or do you just do the producing? I do the producing. Gotcha. Ooh. Oh, fish on the back, fish on the back, grab him. Oh, there's a fish head, grab that one, grab that one. There you go. Other big Spanish. Man, loaded up with these guys today. Those are monsters, too here catching bait wow. that was perfect you let him go wow david <laughs> come on david that sucker's fat that's a big spanish he ate that uh, tsunami glass minnow told david to catch bait and this is what he keeps catching little baby trigger fish come on dude <laughs> step up your game we need to build an aquarium they are blowing up behind us here. They're actually coming, they're moving this way. Y'all should be on immediately here. Here, come take this one and start reeling it. Start reeling it, start reeling it. Reel it, reel it, reel it. Oh, he's fighting it, there he is. Fish on. <laughs> Look at him, man. It's a feeding frenzy right here around the boat. Throw that uh, shrimp out. Yeah. You should be on. Oh, there he is. Fish on. Fish on. Nice job, man. Look at this. Just a feeding frenzy out here. We've got birds and we've got mackerel blowing up all around the boat. Cool. Go ahead, you're gonna be on. Start reeling it quick, because they're super aggressive right now. Yeah. 
There he is. Oh! <laughs> Thought he came off. Another good one on up here. Is that a bonita? Nope, big giant Spanish, man. That is a monster Spanish. Look at that. Oh, look at that cuda. Big cuda following him. Holy Show cow. Him Hold him right. Yeah, let's see if he'll uh, chase him up. Big barracuda following him. All right, reel it in. Because I'll put him on a bigger pole if that cuda follows him back up. A good one hooked up right here. He's breaking in the new band stall. <laughs> I don't know what we got, man. I'm kind of uh there he's up top. I'm curious, man. He's on top like a cobia, man. He's that's a that looks like a cobia, David. He's on top like a cobia. I'm not kidding. I don't know if it is. It's either a cobia or a big bull red. This dude ate a Berkeley gulp. We were just blind casting this bank. And this fish ate a Berkeley gulp. We don't know what it is, but he's a good one. It's a big jack, big jack kerbal. That is cool. They're a pretty fish. Look at him right there. That's cool. Put a ton of pressure on him because that's uh, that's not super heavy tackle. Gotcha. Yeah. These fish, pound for pound, are probably the hardest fighting fish out there, hands down. I th I would think. He's about ready, David. You probably met him or grab him by the tail. There you go. Cool. Well, you broke the reel in, man. I did. I did. Thank you. <laughs> Awesome. That's a good fish. Hold him up. Yes. Nice. Nice. Awesome, dude. Yeah, that's a pretty one, man. I don't know. I think David's more excited than anybody because we've got him a big, a big shark bait. <laughs> All right, let me see him. Pretty cool seeing the blues while you're out here fishing. I'd go back out to the pier if I were you guys. It's probably going to be really good for Pompano this afternoon. That is the plan. Guys, do y'all want y'all's fish filleted or whole? We'll just take it whole. Okay, cool. That'll work, man. All right, David. Start taking them Spanish and putting them in the cooler. I think I think these guys are hungry too. You may, they want a Spanish. <laughs> David, do that again. Fake them, fake them out. <laughs> They're like, screw you guys. Yeah, I'll probably put up some footage from today's trip yeah, on, yeah. on the channel, so check it out, and I'll sure, send sure. you, uh, I'll send you whatever uh, cool, I man. have please, of that please. jack and stuff. Yeah, yeah, so, right, guys, y'all take man. care. Yep, yeah, had fun, enjoyed it. Yeah, man, see ya cool trip man that was a couple of my youtube subscribers man we had a great morning out there caught a lot of big spanish it's nice to have a deck can out there that can help me out 
um, and uh, he caught a nice jack corval saw a bunch of other stuff so it was a, it was a cool trip man it was great weather we had a good time now i'm headed back to the dock to end the day